In this update, INQ recently announced the next stages of its partnership with Hyundai Motor Company to develop the vehicles of the future. Hyundai Motor Company and INQ will work to develop on INQ's quantum computer machine vision algorithms capable of conducting object detection on three-dimensional data from autonomous vehicles. And additionally, the two companies will utilize INQ's quantum computers to simulate electrochemical reactions of varying metal catalysts. And furthermore, these new projects actually build upon previous work between the two companies and further the role that quantum computers have in developing the smart, environmentally friendly vehicles. So let's break this down a bit. In the race to develop reliable and autonomous vehicles for the future, of course, just about everyone thinks of Tesla, but no one really thinks of Hyundai. And I'm not saying that Hyundai will overtake Tesla or anything like that, but Hyundai is definitely putting a lot of time and effort into research and development for the future of autonomous vehicles. Ongoing research between INQ and Hyundai have the two companies applying quantum machine learning to image processing where images, such as road signs, are encoded into quantum state for classification and object detection. And the initial success of these early projects has led Hyundai to pursue additional joint research with INQ on a number of new techniques. And of particular interest in this new endeavor is the analysis of spatial and environmental data from LiDAR and other sensors, which could improve vehicles' understanding of the nature and location of objects, people, and the environment around them. You see, quantum machine learning techniques being investigated at INQ have shown the potential to learn faster and be more effective in recognizing edge cases, generalize better, learn from lower resolution and noisy data, and capture complex correlations with far lower numbers of parameters. And it's these deep technical advantages that can ultimately lead to quicker, safer, and more accurate decisions without user input. And additionally, Hyundai's early efforts to study lithium compounds and the chemical reactions involved in battery chemistry has led the group to expand its current scope and explore new metal catalyst chemical reactions for future vehicles. The collective insights and knowledge gained from the quantum simulations will enable Hyundai engineers to potentially develop higher performance EVs at reduced costs. And I think this is a nice segue that ties into INQ's next big update, because even more recently, INQ's scientific leadership team presented results from its advanced battery chemistry model project with Hyundai Motor Company at the Q2B conference in Santa Clara, California on December 6th through December 8th. The results showcased the advantages of quantum computing in studying lithium compounds involved in next-generation EV battery chemical reactions and how quantum is an effective tool for chemistry simulation. And additionally, INQ also provided an update on its separate machine learning and image recognition project with Hyundai Motor Company, as well as announcing INQ's Forte's availability for Hyundai Motor Group and Airbus. So, for this presentation, the presenters showcase an overview of INQ's ongoing technology and quantum algorithm innovations with Hyundai in the areas of lithium batteries and computer vision before diving into the application advances and hardware results that illustrate the anticipated quantum advantage in these areas. And keep in mind, these forward-thinking investments are key parts of Hyundai's strategy to build mobility solutions for their vision of the future, which is both smart and sustainable. And like I mentioned, at this conference, INQ announced the availability of INQ Forte for Hyundai and Airbus, where the system will see use in Hyundai's chemistry research and machine learning work, as well as Airbus's cargo loading optimization project, which was announced this fall. And just for a bit of context, INQ Forte features 32 connected qubits and enables quantum algorithms to be tested at much larger scales, paving the way for more realistic modeling of real-world quantum applications in multiple industries. And with the all-to-all -all connectivity between qubits, quantum application developers can write more efficient quantum programs. So yeah. Overall, I think this is some really exciting stuff, and I hope it helps to better illustrate why I'm invested in INQ. Yes, there's still a speculative play, but I think given enough time, 
INQ will be able to continue with their research and rise to the top of the quantum computing industry, especially when they're working together with huge partners like Hyundai. And with that, I think I'd like to wrap up the video here. Thanks as always, and I'll catch you next time.